Aloha, and welcome to another titillating episode of Hot Import Nights Hawaiian Style. I'm your host, Amber Lancaster, coming at you from the island of Oahu. The island of sun and surf was host to the motor and model madness we all know so well. For all you howlies that didn't drop the cash for the flight to Honolulu, we'll take you there and give you all the goods we had inside. The island of Oahu is home to beautiful girls and surf that curls. Pipeline was going off with a winter swell. Once the sun went down, HIN came to life in all its nocturnal glory. The Mazda main stage was popping with Glogo girls shaking it to all the hottest tracks and B-Boys wowing the crowd with the sickest moves. There was a wide array of rides that any tuner would aspire to own. Awards will be given out, but only one will take the throne. But enough out of me. Check it out for yourself. My name is Tony Delgado. I am originally from Pennsylvania, and this is Hot Import Nights. Being stationed in Hawaii is awesome. I kind of joined the military about eight years ago. I mean, I get to go to the beach every day, I see the ocean everywhere. The weather's beautiful. It's awesome. Uh, as far as the car scene in Hawaii, it seems like about half the island is modified. So it's, it's a real big scene out here, especially being so much closer to Japan than the mainland is. The car behind me is a 2006 Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution 9. I uh, bought it back in March of 2005. Oh, it was very stock, brand new, had two miles on the clock. Some of the modifications I've done to this car include a full turbo back exhaust, a boost controller, intake, intercooler pipe and blow off valve, clutch, flywheel. Uh, got my ECU tuned, which I'm currently working on myself. As far as my suspension is concerned, all I did right now, I put a set of springs. The wheels and tires are stock. I painted the stock wheels to how they look now. This car is by far not a show car. This is my daily driver. I race it, I drive it to and from work every day. I've had the car for less than a year. It's already over 10,000 miles. After doing modifications, what I'm putting down to the ground is 336 horsepower and 321 foot-pounds of torque. The driving experience with this car is just incredible. I mean, every time you hit, you know, 23 pounds of boost, which I'm running right now, it just, the, the feeling of the car sinking you back in your seat, you know, it almost makes you want to throw up. It's crazy. Right now, we're going about 100 miles an hour. I don't really look at my speedometer that much. I keep my eye on the RPM gauge mostly. That's about 7,000 RPMs in fourth gear. The crew I'm part of is Club 808. We're about 25 deep right now. With, uh, Mitsubishi, Subarus, we have two Dodges. Uh, pretty much all of us are all-wheel drive except for one, which is front-wheel drive. And all of us have turbo, you know, we're all boosted. And it's just pretty much a group of friends. We just decided to give ourselves a name. We're Club 808, and you're watching Octane TV. Bitches! <laughs> Sally Marie. I am from LA, California. I'm a go-go dancer slash import model. My personality, the way I can describe myself, would be very hyperactive, enthusiastic, um, very friendly, very random, kind of, kind of a dork. What I love about go-go dancing, I guess it's just the passion to entertain people. I mean, when they see you, you know, they just want to dance more, and all the ladies, I love it when they come up and like they want to grab my ass. It's like a dream job to get paid to go to the club to dance. My signature move would have to be, um, you know, popping my booty from left to right and shaking it really fast. My birth sign is a Scorpio. We are very, very sensual, romantic, and if you ever cross us, we will get you back. Uh, I can't say I've never kissed a girl before. Um, I've had tried a couple times, and then of course, sometimes, you know, drunken moments with my friends, and we just don't even care, we just go right at each other. It's all just for fun, really, nothing ever serious. I, I like I like men too much, never crossover. The weirdest place I've ever had sex would have to be in a tree. <laughs> just climbing around, and then like, one thing led to another, and it's all spur of the moment kind of thing, and I just went and went for it. Very interesting. It'd be very acrobatic for that one. Hi, this is Miss Italian Marie. Thank you for watching HIN Hogging TV. <laughs> 